Sometimes when I want to make an important decision or even a not so important decision, I overthink it. I'll analyze it, think about the pros and cons and all the what ifs. But the best decisions I ever made in my life were the ones that I didn't put much thought into. The best decisions I made, I went with my first thought, my first feeling, or my first gut instinct. The subconscious mind is a very powerful tool that I and probably most people often overlook. Some decisions probably are best made using logic, reasons, and consideration over time, such as buying a car, a house, or making a compromise with someone where you have to consider their input as well, as well as your own. But have you ever seen a couple argue about where they're going to eat that night? You've probably done it. <laughs> but sometimes one person likes to eat the same kind of thing over and over again, while the other person likes to try something new each time. But what about when you're by yourself? You might consider what sounds good right now. You'll think, well, this option's too expensive, or this other option's too far away, or you name it. Why it's not a good idea right now. But have you ever taken an hour long to make up your own mind about what you want to eat for your own self right now? I use this example because everybody eats. But why do we sometimes have such indecision with our own self? Are we that hard to get along with? Our own self? Probably not, <laughs> debatably. But there are consequences to all of our decisions, including something as simple as getting something to eat. It could be health consequences, financial consequences, and sometimes you just have to eat pizza. Has someone ever asked you to go out and do something, but you were too shy or too, lacked confidence to say yes to it, but wish you had gone? Have you ever had trouble deciding where you want to apply for a job? You could apply for a job that you think you definitely qualify for, or you could apply for a job that you really, really want, even if you don't meet all the qualifications. Why not try both and see what happens? So I'm going to try and take my own advice by starting to make more decisions quickly and following through. Because I believe life is about following your passion. If following your passion means taking perceived risks, and my passion and my subconscious will help guide me to make the right decisions. Now, I'm still gonna make mistakes, probably a lot at first in this process, but is there any reason to regret mistakes that helped you learn the lessons for your best expansion? If I don't go for it, an opportunity presents itself and make that decision with heart. I could look back at my life and say, I should have followed my first thought, my first feeling, or my first gut instinct every day. <laughs>